Oh my, my, my. It's Monday and I'm feeling alive. You know what? Um, it's Monday. <laughs> it's Monday. And there is so much emphasis right now on so many things. And I know a lot of people are feeling sad. I choose not to. I choose not to. I have too many good things going on in my life. I have had much sadness in my life. I've had much, uh, me and death are like that. You know, so I've seen more death than I, I ever want to see, been around more death than I ever want to be around. I mean, it's just like, you know, we walk hand in hand, but, you know, when you're me, it's like that. Yet another example of when you actually out here trying to share good news, there are forces and entities that don't want you to share your joy, even in the midst of drama and misery and death. I have seen too much death. I have made a post below that it says what it says. If you can't do the math, then that's on you. You know, I laugh how some people, you know, I, I had some people who will, shall forever re remain nameless in my book who said, well, you know what? We'll be sure we mask up so you won't make us sick. No, I'll tell you what. I'll be sure that I won't come around you so you won't make me sick. You might get this good, healthy mind. <laughs> But you guys keep calling Jesus, 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 or Holy Spirit. Now now the, the word Holy Spirit, the two words Holy Spirit has been replaced, uh, has replaced Jesus. But I don't care if you, you can call Jesus Allah, Buddha, Candyman, Candyman, Candyman. You can even call my Kali. I wouldn't try to do that, though, if you weren't me. But, you know, you can say these names over and over and over again. But if your intention is not there, if you're just mentioning a name like, you know, you're putting on a sweater, I'm wearing a Louis V sweater, but that doesn't make you Louis Vuitton. A label doesn't make you who you are. What makes you who you are is who you are and who you are on the inside. So I'm just saying, it's really sad the people who are just dropping dead like flies. Some people who have been sick, some people who are never sick, some people who've taken 50,000 Vicks that, you know, your body is not equipped to constantly put that type of toxin to go against the antitoxins in your body. I mean, you know what? You guys didn't grow up a nurse's kid, but you want to listen to these bullshit motherfuckers. Don't be angry. It's a beautiful day. But the fact is, some of these politicians and 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 celebrities and people who work for hospitals who just do it for the money and you and you celebrate them like they are the bastions they are the bastards of your community but you celebrate them like they are you are proud of that legacy you stay proud of that legacy i'm gonna stay proud of mine i'm gonna be the great kid that i was being you know the daughter of a master two masters who gave birth to a pretty smart child i've said it before i don't know if kanye was telling the truth but mensa really did want me my mother was for it my daddy and my godmommy, my aunt, were like, hell to the no, no, no. Let her grow up naturally. And that's what's happening right now. People don't want you to see people who grow up naturally, who do things naturally. They want it enhanced. Enhanced substance, enhanced dicks, enhanced clicks, enhanced, enhanced everything. But... Mother Nature is still Mother Nature. Mother Nature will always be greater. Even on a day like today, I am, uh, you know, it's a beautiful day, but I, it's just water everywhere. My toilet has literally, like, just exploded. Something happened. Like, one of the things, valves broke. And so, you know, I handle my biz. You know, I'm that type of kid. I don't go running. And somebody's going, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? What am I going to do? You just do what you have to do. You know, at this at this point of the game, you just do what you have to do. I'm like, you know, I'm like, the sun is looking on me, and my mommy's going like, we taught you. We taught you. The industry didn't teach you. These politicians didn't teach you. The TV didn't teach you. You taught the TV. You taught the radio. You taught the industry. They don't have to give you the credit or the credibility. We did that already. Don't focus on them. Focus on us. Focus on you. Focus on me because I am we. I am the. We are we. And so that's what I'm saying. People do this talk about Holy Spirit or God or whatever what you believe in, but you act like you believe in a lie. <laughs> you act. You act. Notice how all the people that were sent Pepsi won commercials, by the way. Is Pepsi getting ready to go bankrupt? I'm just saying. 
there's a lot of money. I think did someone say it takes about seventeen million dollars or something like that for a thirty-seven, a thirty-second spot on the Super Bowl. So think about how much money was put in those commercials, and a lot of you are starving, or you want to send money being sent to the Ukraine or whatever. And, but you have starving kids right here. You have military families. You have military families who you think are making all the money, and they are not. Their bosses, the bosses' bosses are, the politicians are, the soldiers themselves are not. They're just experiments. Everybody's a nigga this year. So uh, whether you like it or not, but I'm just I'm just saying, but you got $17 million on a 30-second spot. And then you look at the cost of how much did it pay. How much did it cost to pay like these famous celebrities, these super famous celebrities who haven't had work, haven't, I know, I know. Hello. Oh, right over my head. <laughs> I know. I know. I know. I know, baby. I know. I know. I know. I know. It's always the confirmation, right? So I'm just saying, you 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 spit because they need. I'm telling you, they're some of the ones who like. Listen, don't be asking me to pay back my SBA loan when you haven't asked them. You know what I'm saying? You get nothing. But I pay my bills, so that's why I can uh, get my water fixed. So I'm having a few little problems right now, but luckily I planned ahead. Luckily I planned ahead. See, God doesn't do that. You do that. You have to plan ahead. You don't keep doing stupid shit. And then God is going to save you. This is where we are right now. This is the de-evolution of mankind. You keep doing the same stupid ass shit, and you think God, or God is... God is so not going to save you. Nope. You need to change. You need to change. You need to do something different. And you need to do it now. Or you can die. That's just it. And that's why people are dying. People are dying because you catered to the lie. Because something in you went, I don't know about this, but you did anyway because you were pushed to. Part of that is not your fault, but part of it is. Because at the end of the day, you have a choice. I knew when I took that infusion, I fully, I was fully well aware that you came back. You are not going anywhere, are you? I was fully aware that that was that could have ever been a death sentence because they said it. It could kill you or it could help you. So I was an experimental child from jump. But at the time, I was in such a state of mind. I was dealing with so much bullshit. I was, I was tired of the community. I was tired of the industry. I was tired of dealing with some bullshit motherfuckers in, 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 in California. Y'all can miss me. I mean, Arizona, California, all that. Miss, you know, anything that comes from that don't, don't. And just, and I started seeing the really weird shit. You know, more beyond queer shit, the weird, super weird shit. And, you know, I'm a weird kid, but I'm not that weird. But this is what you don't know about me is that I'm always on my integrity. I'm telling you, I am on my Nina in 2023. Nina, Nina, Nina. No integrity, no access. Hashtag Nina, N-I-N-A. Hashtag N-I-N-A. No integrity, no access. You don't have no integrity you get no access to me on no level i'm saving my money to defeat these devils that i'm having to deal with personally because when i was at my greatest need none of you motherfuckers helped me so please don't ask me what's wrong with val no what's right with me naturally dope and you mad at me? What are what's what's that shit that you got? Y'all y'all just bring smoke, man. I'm talking about fire, straight hell, fire, water, and everything. I got water all over the place. I had to shut my water off to settle down for a minute and breathe and do this. Getting back to Pepsi One because I am a commercial expert. Those who don't know, you can say that I'm not. People who don't know don't know me. People who do know me won't say it anyway because I'm always been better than them. Ego, please. We knew who did the best commercials. We know who still do the best commercials. Either way, I don't care. You got the blue check. I got the green check. I'm good. But back to Pepsi One. Do you know anyone who drinks Pepsi One? I don't know anyone who drinks Pepsi One. Yet they spent at least, at least one, two, three, four, five, at least... Yeah. Oh 
almost a hundred million dollars on Pepsi One commercials for something nobody drinks. That's me thinking about drinking a Pepsi One now. Now you think everybody, goes, well, I'll see, you know what? She's giving us credit. Now everybody's going to go out and taste it. No, everybody's not going to go out and taste it because those who don't know, ask yourself for once, do the math. Do you know anyone who drinks Pepsi One? Anyone? Anyone? I know no one. And I know quite a few people. But go with that. But that was a hundred million dollars that could have gone to something positive instead it went to a no nothing brand i mean pepsico is pepsico but for for nothing for what for pepsi one that was a stunt in the face that was like a stunt in the face that was almost like a garden bait stunt in the face we're going to spend all this much money on a product we know no one doesn't like and yet you have the nerve to want to talk about the plight of America and what's going on with our youth. Or with our people. Or with our soldiers. And that you see us. I don't think you see us at all. I think you see our money. That's what you see. But you don't see the work. You see the pretenders, but you don't see the real Avengers. And you don't see me, but you do see me. I, I know you see me. You just don't want to say you see me. Because if you actually admit you saw me, you will have to actually admit how I have affected you, one way or the other. And we all know I have affected many of you in ways of integrity. We all know I was never the one to suck a dick to get to the top. I never sucked a click to get to the top. I don't do that shit from the very beginning. I said, I don't fuck my way to the top, and I don't allow nobody to fuck me. I am my mom and my daddy's daughter. How else would you think I'd be? So you think I'm just going to, like, do something different for a little money? Bitch, that money's temporary. Integrity lasts forever. If you have it. If you don't, that's why it doesn't last. But anyway, that's all I had to say. I'm, like, waiting with my water shut off. But I have water all around me, though. So, you know, if I wanted to take a shower, take a bath, or, or anything, and I got a tank full of gas. So, you know, I'm good. I'm chilling. I'm working. Good day, sunshine. Good day. Day sunshine and all these mofos that continue to plug into my line everything you do seems to come right off of my timeline I can look at something and went wait didn't I do that didn't I do that didn't I do that didn't I do that too what is a kitty cat hey baby I'm just looking at this little white kitty cat that has not moved <laughs> it's like right in front of me. uh yeah yeah yeah, I think the birds have spoken, so that's it. That's all I had to say. Have yourself a good day. I think... <laughs> that would be cool. Let's go walking. There we go. Let's go walking. I can always go to Starbucks to go to the bathroom. There we go. Oh, Lordy. Here you come. Don't worry about it. Where you going? Where you going? Yeah, that's a water. That's the water that's in the stream. That's a little pond that's in the yard. Where you going? You you find in the wet. Yeah, because cats don't like water, so they say <laughs> you go where the water is like lesser. You're good. You're good. You're good. Hey, sweetie. What? What's up, baby? You're scoping the territory? Hey, sweetums. Meow one more time. Let me, no, let me, let me stop doing that. Let me stop doing that. I gotta stop doing that. I gotta stop doing that. I, that, I, I do that and then all pets like, oh, 
oh, she, no, 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 no. I'm too friendly. I am too friendly. I must learn how to observe and watch and not enter, engage. Observe and watch and not engage. Observe and watch and not engage. Stay in your bubble. Make sure you are paid. This year is about the money in your pocket. I'm not here to be a slave to anyone. I saw all my influences last night, and I know what I saw. And you know what I know? I know you're going to pay me, too. That's what I know. I know you're going to pay me, too. That's what I know. But I know if you are bullshitting me, or if you have been bullshitting me, or you've been trying to use me, I know someone, if you turned around and sucked off on all my cousins and all my family and thought that, well, I'm going to get closer to her, you can keep all those motherfuckers, okay? Because here's the deal. When I cut off people, I cut off people. My cut off game is ice cold, baby. Da -da 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 ice cold cold baby my cutoff game is like that moon rock commercial that blue moon commercial that commercial was hot i don't know what that guy was talking about on the news after the after the super bowl last night all the stuff he was talking about he was like that was a boring ass white man like you didn't see nothing you didn't see nothing that commercials you were talking about were good were not good at all all and the worst ones we all know that avocado again that avocado that avocado adam and eve avocados from mexico that commercial was the worst that was like why is even jack harlow important I mean, you know, some of you people should be fucking mad at that. He got money and you didn't. I'd be mad if I were in your position. And you know, consider all this Philly, 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 Philly. This is no disrespect to Philly because, listen, I was all rooting for my Philly boys, man. I was rooting for y'all, but best team won. And Andy Reid is Andy Reid is the luckiest son of a bitch uh, in 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 football. And that's all I'm going to say about it. Andy Reid has powers that we shall not talk about. It's not my enemy. Y'all went mad when it was Bill Belichick. <laughs> I'm just saying it is what it is. I mean, it's what it is. So, uh, so yeah, well, that was a hard loss for Phil. There was a lot of people. Now you know. Now you know. Now you know. Now you know how Falcons and Braves fans feel. Oh, it's the brightest man, never bright. Oh, well, anyway, but it was a good game. It was, really was a good game. And I enjoyed myself. And, of course, I wake up this morning and ploop. But you know what? It's a good day. And uh, and, and then I wake up and, and to, I mean, we, we learned that last night. You know, again, shout out to, uh, uh, not shout out, but, you know, that was, I meant to say that. Uh, rest in peace to, uh, mm today uh there's so many people there's so many people in in this last in the last year who who you know from health issues from not being able to take care of their health to you know has nothing to do with Dave's death but like from the fentanyl to uh I, I I keep telling you everybody who you know and they can clock this out all they want to fuck this oh there go all the birds oh my god there go the three of them you know, you 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 celebrate people who celebrate Dr. Fauci, and unless Dr. Fauci came around, and well, you know, he did turn around at the end, but you missed that part where where in the beginning when he was like literally killing everybody, and then at the end he's like, yeah, no, we kind of made a mistake. You gotta miss that part, but who are you celebrating? You celebrate liars and trenders, and tre you celebrate people who you think are famous or people who you know like politicians or celebrities put like these are the people you're supposed to pay attention to and you don't have a clue that these people don't even know what they're talking about or they do but it's all about money it's all about money if you think they care about your health 
they don't. If you think they care about your wealth, they don't. We already knew they didn't care about black and brown people. Tan people, they don't give a damn about you. Yellow people, they don't care about you either. But you know that. Cause, so you, you've, been on your, you've been on your revenge game for a minute. I can't hate good gamemanship. I can't, I mean, you know, I can't hate good gamemanship. And, uh, Red, well, uh, whew, whew, Lord. Uh, and, and what happens when it's all in you? So it's really interesting when people say, I am history. What history am I? I'm all of them. So don't come to your so-called race. Don't come to me and think, think you don't know me without actually having a conversation talking to me face to face because if you come at me with some dumb stupid thinking I'm kissy shit I will I will stick my six and a half foot Thomas Jefferson nine foot all over your ass don't get scared now when the victim decides to fight back oh you want to glitch now when I say I'll put my foot up your ass and make it come out your mouth where you will be Bitten truth? God damn right. You gonna know me to death. Y'all can take an honest sister. Y'all can take someone when someone's being honest. But you can't take someone riding the pole. You take these bad baddie bitches. You can take these, oh, I do this, oh, I do that. You can take these ones who's got these claws out. Like, what kind of work they gonna do? What type of bitch is a ride or die bitch and she's got claws that looks longer than her goddamn children? Her claws look like knives themselves. What can she do? Can that bitch really clean and cook? Can she really take care of a baby and do diapers? I mean, if you can, then I'm impressed with you. If you wear those nails all the time, but for those of us who actually have work to do, there's not one soldier. You will not find one soldier. You will not find one woman in the military who has claws five inches long because you have to actually do you have to lock and load and work and get down in this shit. If you a real soldier, you want a real soldier chick. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying you got to be in the military, but you got to have some type of mentality. You got to have values of being a warrior. And these bitches that got nails out to here, they're nothing but tricks. Call it what it is. Let a hoe be a hoe. Bitch, I ain't hating on your... Don't you ever come up in my face and acting like you were better than me. Are you shitting me? Bitch, I busted my ass for you to do the shit that you do. You fucked up your PPP. I didn't. You the one that's got the CIA and the FBI and everybody watching you, not me. How dare you? Act like a punk ass hoe. Where the real women at? Remember when we had real music and real hip hop? Real people? But it stopped and someone knew it. So now... You got the ones who I already grew up to. You feel real sad about it. I've been feeling real sad. That's why I'm not, you know, my show is back to me. I don't give a damn about who climbs a chart. I don't give a damn about who does what. I don't care. I never seen that before. What is that sad? Anyway, I'm just saying, I'm just keeping it real today. It's Monday, 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 and it's a very real day. And you know what's real? Life is real. They say life is a game, but no. The Matrix is a game. Life is very real. Get sick and see if that doesn't feel real. Oh, well, it's in your mind. It's in your mind. Well, sometimes it is in your mind, but sometimes it's really your life. When your blood pressure is sky high, do you recall I had an ischemic stroke like Sinbad? It's a little bit different stuff to me and Sinbad. I had uh I have chronic kidney disease. I have chronic kidney disease. Stage four. It was going on stage five. Now at least it's coming up. I've got uh the high blood pressure, which is on point. And yet I I, I stand and sit here by myself at 66, acting like she's so tough. She should have the weight of the world. Mom and dad gone, hubby murdered, no justice, no peace, a whole community in the industry after her, and yet she still stands strong and speaks what she speaks with such authority, like she is a walking god.
God is like, she is an Anunnaki. I don't know what I am, but I know what I ain't. I ain't a stupid bitch and I ain't a stupid trick. And if you want to come to me, then you can get yourself done in quick. Or taught. Either way, I'm just having a good day. So you all can go and be sad if you want to. But actually, I'm good. I'm just going to wait until my bathroom gets fixed. And I'm going to uh, get me some food. Might get me some coffee. Might go on a walk. And uh, finish my shows. Put some in the can. And just fix up my house. Because I can. And look here, Ma. Look here, sir. I did it without a man in my life. I am responsible for myself. Hey, kitty, kitty. And there goes the other one. My porch. I'm not a grifter. I'm not living in a bando. This is not much, but I actually own it. Ownership is everything. So I own this piece of I own this piece of a house that is a wonderful, beautiful house. Like I own my car. Technically I do own it. I mean I'm still paying off on the bank, but about another year I will own it. Maybe this year. My book sales do what they want to. It'll be this year. And I own my own life. And I own my story. I don't need no one, none of them, none of you, to ever co-sign or verify my story. Because I still am what I am, regardless of whether you see it or not. It doesn't matter whether you see it. It only matters does nature see it. And nature sees it clearly. And that's why, regardless of what's going on today, I smile and actually am having a great day. Seriously. Birthday season. See, son? Don't bring me no bad news. Don't bring me no bullshit. Don't bring me a bitch that I'm going to have to slap back into their reality. Because your reality is not mine. Don't bring me no bitches. This, how can we help you? You cannot help me. You're trying to help you. And don't ever threaten me on some dumb shit and think I won't do what I have to do. I'm not a punk. I'm not a slave. I'm about love. If you come and throw some fuck shit my way, I will fuck you up. See, more than scared of you, I'm scared of me. There's a side of me that you don't ever want to see. I realized that when I was looking at some movie yesterday, last night, yesterday. It was after Rampage. What was it? It was Rampage too, but it was after Rampage. Oh, Skull Island, King Kong. I mean, it was like, and my husband used to notice that too. My husband used to notice that, that movies, like I told you, Xena, the warrior princess and stuff like, I don't know what, I don't, I don't, I don't know what, I don't, I'm not a, I'm not the typical girl, but that don't make me a bi or, or a dyke or anything like that. And I'm just keeping it real because, you know, you have to be real with some people, you know, y'all are hardcore and there'd be some hardcore rapey people like that. And I'm telling you, I have had that happen to me one, uh, several times. Listen, I don't give a damn if you are a man or a woman. I will fuck you up, bitch. No means no. No means no. Don't get me in no traps or no tricks or no nothing. That's why I don't do this industry shit. I don't do this weird shit. I don't do this queer shit. I don't do this like you got to suck a dick to get a billionaire. Fuck your billionaire status, bitch. I'll be fine. You keep your blue check. I'm good with my green check. And I guarantee you, if this government cuts out the green checks, you don't want that. If this government is this stupid, if you're stupid enough to take out your own soldiers, you deserve the revolution you get. I'm here for it. I told you, I love good gamesmanship. Let's play. Let's go. Let's go. Season? Season. Yes, the aliens maybe are here. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Am I one? I don't know. I don't know what I am. I'm just a little chick in my little TARDIS. Mind my own 
business where everybody's eyes on me, thinking that I can't see. But I saw everything I need to see in that football game. Everything. I saw a different game than you did. And maybe we did see the same game. Either way, I'm up here happy, waiting for my water to get fixed. Today, the person says, but just in case. You always have a backup plan. That's what my aunt used to tell me. I always have a backup plan. It's like with tires in a car. A tire can go flat. So, you know, you don't just hang around with like that's why they always sell you a car with an extra tire in case the tire goes flat you driving around if four men are driving your chariot you might want to have one handy in case one goes flat I don't even know why I said that I'm not I don't play like that Someone will swear out I do, but I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't. I have not played on anybody's heart. I don't think, I hope if I did, I, I apologize. But, uh, what did you do? But, uh, anyway, I know the birds, the bird, okay. Okay, the birds saying, come out and play. Let's go walking. Let's walk. I'm trying to be patient and wait for my thing to get fixed. I can work on my show. That's it. Business. Business Monday. Da, 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 da. And I had all I had to say. Thank you. I'm very blessed today. I am very blessed today. I'm alive. And I'm happy. And it's quiet. And I have And I have a community that they may be crazy, but at least they know that shit is really shit. We don't know what she is, but we seen her in person. She really shit. I don't like you fake ass motherfuckers. You're not even worth my spit. That's why in 2023, I'm not going anywhere. But I do expect my Rockefeller bunny. We have stories to tell. So, until next time, that's mine. always has to be a balance you got to figure out where is your balance and how do you want to make it right and is it productive if you were trying to make your balance right and you wanted to invest in something productive would you invest in a lion hoe or would you invest and the one who actually walks her walk. She is the sauce. She is the bag. She is the story. She owns herself. She doesn't need the help. She would like to have it. She had to learn from herself, from herself and for herself That she doesn't need the help. Like she doesn't need the company. You would just like to have it if it fits your flow. If it doesn't, gotta go. And some of y'all who have never fitted my flow, fit it. Who tried to make me force fit and go low. So I had to make myself lesser than you to be that's what it was make myself lesser than you to be around you because my shine was too bright that little nitpicking you know like how you have this little nitpicky those little nitpicky motherfuckers they ain't that were never going to do anything right and they were always jealous of you from day one they were always the cane to your able you were always the different one you were always the chosen one you were always the one that the grandparents saw that's the one that's my seed that's the one who I give the keys to. But you stole the keys. Oop, gotta go.
business right on time. Yep. <laughs>